our wonderful mummy and daddy. Yes, it's me, your little fairy, Fifi. And I, along with Toto and Poppy, have a message of love that we want you to hear. Also, please tell my doggy mama, Muffy, Harmony, and Natalie, that this message is for them too. Just as surely as you know how much you loved us when we were with you, you can be sure that there is a doggy heaven. And that's where we are now. So please don't worry about us. Of course, we miss all of you, but we are safe and happy here. Since I was the first one to arrive here, I waited at the bridge to welcome Toto and Poppy when they crossed the bridge. So be happy for us that the three of us are together now. Toto, tell them about Dog Heaven. Hi, Mummy and Daddy. Toto here. There are perfect temperatures for us here and more toys and activities for us to be involved in than you could ever imagine. And the angels, oh, the angels. They're so nice and loving to us. We have two special angels that are all ours here. They even look quite a bit like you two, Mommy and Daddy. We even asked them if we could call them Mommy Angel and Daddy Angel, and they said sure. So they are the angels we spend most of our time with. And yes, all three of us still watch over all of you, just like we did when we were with you physically. Tell them more, Poppy. Hi, Mommy and Daddy. Poppy, your little froggy doggy here. Everything we did with you, we do here in doggy heaven also, and we act the same way too. When we wake up in the morning, your dainty little Fifi barks her head off until Mommy Angel picks her up. Then I start yelling, Mommy Angel, Daddy Angel, let's go to the lake today. I want to take a swim. And Toto still has that little habit of wanting to know what, when, and how much are we going to eat today. But here in Doggy Heaven, Toto never tries to pinch Fifi's and my food. Wanna know why? Listen to this. Our angels told us that here we can eat as much roast chicken and our special cookies that taste just like Daddy's cookies as we want, and we never have to worry about getting chubby. Sacre bleu! How cool is that? Okay, you two. Let me talk again now. Just like when we were with you, we love to take long walks in the many forests here. And as you might guess, we performed the same excited pre-walk routines we did with you. I go into my spinning in circles act, Poppy starts hopping like a little lamb, and of course Toto insists on being the first one harnessed, even though here we don't even need to be harnessed. Mummy and Daddy, our angels get the giggling so hard at the three of us that we start giggling too. <laughs> So see, we have a great life here, much like the life we had with you that we loved so much. We love you and dedicate this song to you. We will live forever in your hearts and minds, our friends, if you cherish all the memories you have of us and then. When you think of us, be happy for all the time we had. If you must cry, cry tears of joy. Don't cry because you're sad. For the reason we were sent to you is simple, but it's true. In the too brief time we had together, we had a job to do to make you smile and brighten up your days, if just a bit. We know we did our jobs so well we were a perfect fit. So think of us real often, of the great times that we had. Don't let your memories of us cause sorrow. Please be glad that we could share a bond so close, soulmates through and through. Just close your eyes, reminisce and smile. We're always there for you. Well, we have to go now. We can hear one of our angels calling us to take a nap. As we said earlier, of course, we miss all of you, 
but we're safe and happy here, too. Mummy and Daddy, I can even see perfectly now. We had such wonderful lives with you when we were with you physically, and we could never tell you until now just how much we appreciated how you gave us such a safe, happy, and loving home. Thank you so much for making us members of your family, not just your pets. For that, we will be eternally grateful to you. Mummy and Daddy, I want to add my thank you for everything you did for me. It was the luckiest day of my life, the day I met you. As you know, my life before I found my happiness with you two was not very nice. Before I met you, I never in my wildest dreams could have imagined that I would end up having such an awesome, loving, forever home as I had with you. And Mommy, I have a special request for you. Please stop blaming yourself for my passing. When I was with you, I was simply telling you that yes, I was sad that it was my time. But I was also telling you that, Mummy, I love you. But God is calling me to come back to Him and to thank you for taking such good care of me. You did all that you could for me. You always did. I also want to thank you, Mummy and Daddy, for all the loving care you gave me through my illness and the love you showered upon me. Mummy, I know now that God recognized your very special love for me, and that's why he allowed me to stay with you so long after my illness began. I also know that you try to keep me extra specially close to you by wearing that heart around your neck. Never, ever, think that maybe you should not wear it. It's our special secret. Mummy and Daddy, all three of us are still with you in your hearts, and we know that someday we will all be together again, because that bond of love we share can never be broken. So celebrate all the happy memories we left with you, and visit with us often by viewing this video love letter to you from us. Always remember, whenever you do think of us, smile.